What's up, saints? Got a question. Are you ashamed of the Lord? Are you ashamed of the Lord? And when someone's bringing up the Lord, do you jump in that conversation to try to witness to somebody? Or do you lay low in the conversation? Do you get offended when someone disrespects God? Or do you just sit back, ask why, or whatever? Or do you even care? You see what I'm saying? Because I believe, I see a lot of believers that say they believe in Christ. And sometimes, because I used to be like that when I first got saved, I used to see people that was older than me or who'd been in, been, been in, the, in the Lord longer than me, and they would have this boldness that I really, I had because I was a new believer, but I wasn't ready to go down deep like that. You know what I'm saying? Like I heard, I seen one time I had my friend who was saved and he was he pulls up bumping Christian music and everything and he was yelling my name and pointing to the radio bobbing his head and I was like yo man chill you know what I'm saying like we around people and he was he like so what are we ashamed of Christ because the thing is we gonna want him to not be ashamed of us on that day you see what I'm saying we we we, we ashamed of him when, whenever life's normal or we're going through good times, but see when it hits the fan, we call on him to stop everything for us, and we want him to pull us out. But even after that, we like, look, but I don't want to go deep. So it's like, are we ashamed of our God? Are we ashamed of the one who gives us life? And even after that, the one who will bring us to heaven with him? Who will not be ashamed of us To bring us towards the Father You see what I'm saying Who should be ashamed of who We're nothing without him But even I have fell victim of Cowering out You know what I'm saying And that ain't cool That ain't cool because He deserves so much more From us You know but I ask that question for a lot of people, man. Check yourselves to see, are you ashamed of who you believe in? Are you ashamed of Christ? I know you'll say, oh yeah, I believe in Christ. But you're not ready to defend the faith, right? You're not ready to jump out that window with that, right? I'm not saying be a preacher. I'm not saying be a preacher. I'm saying be ready to give a, give a uh, testimony for the hope that is in you. Like the Bible calls for. Examine yourselves. To see if you're ashamed of who you believe in. Do you speak boldly about Christ? Or do you sit back when you don't want everybody to know you're a Christian? This is my biggest thing right here. This is what I, I see helps is whenever you're in front of somewhere new where people don't know you, jump out, man. Start praying in front of people. Next time you at break, start praying in front of people. Let them see you read your Bible. Not because you're trying to show what you do. You're just trying to let people know, listen, this is how I get down. Right? Now, some people don't want to do that because they don't want to have to live to the standard and be like, I don't want to mess up. You're going to mess up. You're going to mess up. You're going to speak like you don't have like like you don't want to like you don't want to speak sometimes. You're going to say words you don't want to say. Don't be ashamed of your God. Because even in the midst of that, God can show grace to you in front of them. Show forgiveness in front of them. Don't be ashamed of Jesus. Later.